Hey there guys, welcome back to more Scarlet Nexus. Uh, right now, I have to go to Kikuchiba to go talk to somebody. Mid-level shopping district. It's been a couple days that I've played this because I went back to play in Detroit. And I just finished that game, so now I'm back on this game. This place is too exposed. We should go somewhere more private. You're on patrol, so make sure you take out those others. Using Lucas' teleportation would make this easier. If your body begins to burn with fire, it'll drain your health, so be careful. called a brain crush I think those are called brain crushes I have to do as many as I can to level up fast there's a resource reading near here what do you want to do obtain squash rocket There we go. So it's a monster that can make duplicates of themselves. Hmm. You know, I really like the varieties with the enemies. It's not always the same thing. Got some more medium jelly. This area should be safe enough to talk. Is it true that the new Himuka government was transforming people into others? Yes, it was a long time ago. But Fabuki's fiance, Alice Ichijo, was also metamorphosed. My brother and Fabuki began investigating the cause of Alice's metamorphosis. The case led them to find out about new Himuka's personality rehabilitation, metamorphosis technology, and the surveillance systems of each city. Excuse me, do you mean my Aunt Alice? That's right, she was your aunt. 
have you heard anything? No. I was told she joined OSF and planned to leave when she turned 20, but she was killed in the line of duty. That's why my family was in such strong opposition to me being scouted. But since we're legally unable to refuse... Hey, I found the file on Alice Ichijo in the database. She looks exactly like Hanabi. Alice was the daughter of OSF Hospital's previous chairman. That's why she was engaged to Spring Pharmaceutical's Major General Fubuki. I think that's true. It's the first I've heard this, but it seems plausible. If this was a plan led by the new Himuka government, does that mean my father knew about it? Oh. I think he did. Moreover, it might be better to assume that he was at the center of it all. The Sumeragi family has a long history in politics, after all. Then does my brother know about it too? Am I the only one who was kept in the dark? Yuito, Kasane is coming. Eight o'clock. Ah, uh, here we go again. Just hold on. We can talk this over. No point. You'll be dead. Does she want me to fuck over again? Why are you trying to kill me? At least tell me the reason. You won't get away. I told you I don't want to talk. Sorry. Sorry. Oh my god, Jesus! everything to stop you. I just want to stay out of this. Fine. Will you please calm down, Sabini? Sane is out for blood. She may kill us if we don't give it our all. I didn't trust Seto and that got him killed. I won't make the same mistake twice. I'm going to stop Kasane. Stop! Yuita, we should defeat them one by one. Let's nullify the other two, and then Kasane. I guess I'll see you, bitch. Can't hide from me. Stop! Got one. I need you, Kemma. Why? Oh, gotcha. What'd she do? Fuck everyone up. Get him! Some enemies that use powers can create a brain field. Okay, same thing like I can. 
That's gonna be dangerous. You ran out, huh? You ran out! That's what you fucking get! Don't fuck with me! I have to do it! Answer me, Kasane! No. I can't lose now. Kasane, tell me, why did you kill my father and join Seiron? <sighs> Is it because my father was involved in metamorphosis research? Because New Himuka turned Naomi into an other? So you found out about it too. Yes, that's exactly right. Hey, Kodama's coming. What? What is she doing here? Master Yuito, Kodama is here. Huh? Wait, Kasane! Oh, that traitor Kasane is here too? That's fine. It is a pleasure to meet you, Master Yuito. I'm Kodama Malone. I believe this is our first time meeting as well. Oh, you're right! But I'm only loyal to Master Yuito. What? Oh, Master Yuito, I have a message from Master Fubuki. He's taking care of everything, so you can come back now. So, are you on our side, Kodama? Of course! I am always on your side, Master Yuito. Officially, my position may be the leader of Kodama Platoon and Major General Fubuki's aide, but my heart will always belong to you, Master Yuito. You could have just contacted us instead of coming all the way out here, Kodama. Maybe no one trusts you, Wataru. I mean, your sister went to Seiron after all. Shut up. Don't group me in with Haruka. And it wasn't just to deliver a message. I had to give this to you, too. What is it? Your medicine that was discarded at the OSF hospital. Oh. Is that okay? I don't mean to offend my uncle, but isn't it dangerous to take meds from the OSF hospital? Hanabi, and this goes for the rest of you as well, but it's in your best interests not to talk about or criticize the hospital in Suo. I'm sure you know why. Because the government is monitoring everyone. Exactly. Well, I'll be going back now. See you later, Master Yuito. Huh? This ampule? It's the same as the one I found in the abandoned underground subway. Why don't we stop by the hideout before returning to Suo, to go over everything we learned? We won't have to worry about anyone listening there. And don't worry. Recording conversation data through my control system isn't allowed. Now that I think about it, Major General Fubuki probably prohibited recording in order to protect the OSF after he learned the truth about the government. Yeah, maybe. Prescription drug. That was a cool fight. I beat the fuck out of Kasani and her teammates. So much has happened. It feels like my brain is fried. Let's go over our situation first. Research on powers is being conducted at the old Ichijo OSF hospital building. It's likely they progressed in the research of the brain, gained the ability to turn people into others and perform personality rehabilitation. Yes. 
You can't blame yourself. You didn't know about any of this. Yes, you are so kind to everyone. So, I think you should be kind to yourself, too. Thank you. Moving on. The government is well aware that we've come to know this information. Major General Fubuki is trying to put out the fires, but it would be best to consider the possibility that we will become fugitives from the government. Anyone on the run from the government won't survive. Wait, there's Seiron. Yes. Worst case scenario, we should consider fleeing to Seiron. And Yuito, how has your memory been? I haven't had any missing gaps in my memory recently. I think. If anything strange happens, please let us know. Although, concerning that medication you were prescribed... It was prescribed by the OSF hospital. It kinda scares me. Yes, I'm concerned as well. Right. I think it would probably be best to avoid taking it. Unless your condition significantly worsens. You're right. I'll do that. Hey, do you think it would be a good idea to ask my brother about this? Well, yeah, Chief Sumeragi is your older brother. I would advise against it. The Chief is with the government, after all. Of course, he is also your family. But any unnecessary contact would be dangerous right now. I wouldn't want to hinder Major General Fubuki in any way. Yes, you're right. Kaito, were you aware of New Himuka's power experiments? Did Dad and Kaito do that to Nagi? Damn it! The only one that was left in the dark was me. Only me. Stand by phase five. Okay, so I can wander around a little bit. Team bond level. By interacting with your allies, your team's bond strengthens, increasing your team bond level. This gives bonuses like increased rates of guardian vision, assault vision, and revivals. And chances to receive special items. In order to increase your team bond level, you must increase individual bond levels with your teammates, complete bond episodes, and give special gifts to them. So essentially, do everything bond related to individual people, and then together, the level will go up. I'm sorry, Yuito. You're the commander. I shouldn't have interfered. No, you're always so level-headed and helpful. Don't be afraid to tell me what you think. Understood. Oh, was that in order? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'm gonna check if there's any more gifts I can get. Squash Racket. You do not have the necessary items. What do I need? Abandoned Subway Environment A. Okay, that means I have to go to Abandoned Subway then. I can get this. Famous Select Alcohol Set. Okay, let me quickly go to the abandoned subway. Be right back. This is pretty rare. Oh, I think I got it. Was that it? I just got B, but I think that was A. Here we go. All right, I think that's all the new gifts I got, so let's start handing them out. All right, that's all the gifts, so I'm gonna go around and start doing these Bond episodes, but there's uh, there's actually a lot of people to do it, so I'm gonna quickly skip through that. 
All right, I guess that's it. So I just did all the bonding stuff and let's continue. I've been thinking about this too much. My brain is going numb. I should get some rest. Yuito, wake up. Wachiru is on the line. <sighs> Sorry. I only meant to take a little break, but it looks like I fell asleep. So, Wataru, what's up? Is the fact that we snuck into the old OSF hospital going to be an issue? No. Major General Fubuki was able to take care of that for us, so that's not a problem anymore. It might not be a big deal, but I thought I should let you know about the hole in Kunat Highway. Now that you mention it, there was something strange in the sky above Kunat Highway. I guess you could call it a hole. So much happened after that, I'd forgotten about it. So what was it? The government is calling it the Kunat Gate. A survey team took a look, but aside from the extremely localized gravitational anomaly, they don't know anything about it. It's just that it has similar characteristics to a black hole, so that area has been deemed off-limits. Kunat Gate. Nothing could be seen on the other side. It was... unsettling. You might not go there, but I figured it's better to know about it than not. That's true. Thanks for telling me about it. If you learn anything more, please let me know. As you wish. Oh, I almost forgot. Yuito Platoon's next orders are to stay on standby. So you can hang around the hideout a little while longer. Really? Then I think we should do just that. Yes, that is a good idea. Knowing Fubuki, I'm sure he arranged all of this. So I think it's best to comply. Phase six, choice to face it, eyes open. Mind if I come in? Major General Fubuki, how did you find this place? I told him. I thought it would be safer to talk here in the hideout rather than meet in the safe zone every time. Thank you, Luca. I managed to sneak past their surveillance, so we should be fine for a little while. They started monitoring you? I told you before that I was a government dog, but I don't have to be a dog anymore, now that Karin's gone. What do you mean? Karin's personality didn't make him popular with the government. The top brass has been targeting him for elimination or personality rehabilitation for some time now. That's why I took on the role of being the government's puppet, directing the OSF in Karin's place. So, does he... He doesn't know that I had to become his monitor in order to protect him from the government. Besides, even if I told him, he'd probably just tell me to stay out of it. To be honest, I'm a little relieved. I don't have to be the government's yes-man anymore. Government surveillance will be stretched thin after Ceyron's uprising. I don't plan on missing this opportunity. I should be able to bring change to this country by taking a different path from Karin. Different path? What are you planning on doing? This country is aggressively pursuing power research through illegal human experimentations. I have no idea why. They can get away with it because the government has complete control over information. Even the media is under the government's monitoring and influence. I want to find out why they would do this and free this country from its corrupt system. Karin joined forces with Ceyron and rebelled against the state to do the same. However, I feel that collapsing the government system from the inside is the fastest way to results. My brother is trying to change this country from the outside, while you're trying to change it from within. Yes. Feigning loyalty allows us opportunities to learn valuable information. We should be able to find out what the government is hiding through the city computer Arahobaki. Please, let me help you. I want to know what my father has done, and what my brother is hiding. Yuito, you are the commander of this platoon, and a commander's number one responsibility is to their platoon members. If you attempt to pursue these government secrets, it will undoubtedly put your platoon members in danger. Are you fully aware of that? Then please, remove me from command. I can't do that because, for better or worse, there are many eyes on you. There's also the fact that your post was specifically ordered by Chief Kaito Sumeragi. Well, if we all agree with what Commander Yuito is doing, then it doesn't matter. Yama, 
Either way, my time with the OSF is drawing to an end. I'm getting too old. But before I leave, I want to uncover the truth. I want to know why that happened to Naomi, and why Nagi received personality rehabilitation. I agree with Gemma. If you're going to try to uncover the government's secrets, then I would like to help. I was also subjected to this country's human experiments. What do you mean? My brother Karin and I received power enhancement treatments. I had no idea. If Huito can't be removed from the platoon, then you can remove the platoon members instead. Any member who doesn't want to take part in this can simply be assigned to a different platoon. Fine. I can't very well turn down your help now. However, reorganizing your platoon requires paperwork. So I will issue you an official deployment order in the meantime. Please gather intel around the Seiron area. I've heard OSF deserters are appearing around Mizuhagawa. Former OSF members sympathetic to Seiron's cause could be up to something. While you're investigating, I will take the steps necessary to reassign Hanabi and Sugumi to a different platoon. What? Oh. Okay, get to it then. Yuito, I'll stay in the platoon as the operator. I feel the same as you and Gemma. I'll help you stop the government from doing whatever they want. Thanks, Wataru. So as you can see here, I went back to the default outfit because it fits more with the mask that I bought. That was 3,000 of the currency. It's a lot for a mask. Mizugawa District, construction site. I wonder what kind of truths we're gonna uncover. There's a chance that Seiron OSF patrols might show up beyond this point. Let's keep our eyes open. Were you serious about what you said back at the hideout? About helping Major General Fubuki? Right. Because wouldn't that mean going against your brother and your late father? I'm... staying in this platoon. What? Sugumi. What happened to Naomi was terrible. And if the government had something to do with it, then I won't let them get away with it. Hold on. Incoming others from the front. Hanabi, Sugumi, we'll talk later. For now, Hanabi. let's clean up the other. I need your help. Yeah, you're right. On this side. Are there any more others? I'm not reading any. Mm. Yuito, are you okay? Huh? Yeah, I didn't take too much damage in that fight. What are you talking about? You suddenly said your head hurt and stopped dead in your tracks. Huh? Did you black out again? Do you remember what we were talking about? Hanabi asked me if I was really going to help Major General Fubuki, and then Sugumi said she was going to stay in the platoon. And after that? After that, we got attacked by others, so we obviously didn't talk about anything. <laughs> right? 
You don't remember Luca and Gemma's stories? What did they talk about? About my aging and the experiments Luca was subjected to. <sighs> Sorry, I don't remember any of that. Did you really talk about that? Yuito, I was listening so I can verify. I'm not seeing any abnormalities to your status, so maybe it's just mental exhaustion like the doctor said. The more you use your power, the more you tax your brain. It might be better to avoid fights right now. I can't do that. We have our assignment. Hello, what's this? The Matrix is breaking. Are you really okay? Snake boat. Ginger. Huh? What? Flax pig. Table slug? What? None of the words are matching what I'm thinking. Apple home child. <laughs> I see an abnormality in his cranium. What's going on? His speech is impaired. His brain must have experienced a great amount of stress. Well, what can we do? We have the medication the hospital provided. But that ampule seems fishy. It looks exactly like the ampules we found at the abandoned subway. Everyone, be careful. You have an other closing in on you. This timing couldn't be worse. Stay here and rescue Ito. We'll handle the others. Damn it! My head feels like it's going to split in two! Shell. I think I can break it if I focus my attacks. Someone's in trouble. Pay attention. More. More. I have to fight. Come on. Yuito, can't you use your power? I, I can't do anything. This isn't good. I can't use my power at all. I won't even be able to fight. What can we do? Is there some way to cure him? Do I... drink it? Yuito! Squeamish. That other's gonna kill me if I don't take this. I have to. <laughs> Yuito? Did he drink the medication? Sugumi! I'm looking now. Oh, the abnormality in his cranium is starting to disappear. This medication is really working. Uh, my head is starting to hurt a lot less. Yuito, I can understand what you're saying now. Can you fight? Yeah, I'm good to go. Let's take them out. Okay, but what are the side effects? Yuito! I can move. It doesn't hurt as much. I can do this. Hey. picking up any abnormalities on my end. How are you feeling, Yuito? I feel fine now. I know I had you worried, but I'm glad I took it. Honestly, I wasn't going to be any help in that condition. That makes sense. And I'm not seeing any signs of side effects either. Perhaps there was no need to worry about the medication after all. Well, it smelled weird and tasted really bad. Are we going to continue on our assignment? Shouldn't we go back to the hideout and rest a little bit? I'm fine. My powers are working normally again. I'll let you know if something feels off. Let's keep going. 
Copy that. But please don't push yourself too hard. Promise me. Okay. I promise. Can't get it. Nice combos. So I can't detect anything from my end. Any other information? I think they're trucks. Two of them. They're moving towards Ceyron? Hmm? What is it? Mm. I thought I just saw something inside the truck bed. Although, it was probably my imagination. 
Okay, I managed to tap into a nearby surveillance camera feed. Those are OSF transport vehicles. Enemy or ally? Yuito Platoon is the only OSF team deployed near Mizuagawa. Then I guess that means they're Seiron's OSF team. <gasps> I see two individuals heading towards us. It looks like Kagura and Kyoka. <laughs> of course, they're invisible. Be careful, I'm not picking them up at all. All right, right. Here they come. Right. Take that. <laughs> Too late. I wonder why Kyoka and Kaguro attacked us. I thought that Kasane was the one after Yuito. Is it because they're on Kasane's side? Or for some other reason? Regardless, please be careful. I'm using this, Sugumi. Even if you are in this box, my friend will be here. Your power is the absolute worst to go against. I wonder if that's why we're such good friends. If you really think that, then retreat. I don't want to do this. We need to regroup. We're going. Get back here. My old trusted commander is my enemy. Yes, you are a good soldier. I didn't want it to end up like this. Oh, you're done for. They're stronger than anticipated. Let's go. We did what we needed to. Were Kyoka and Kagero guarding this area? Could it have to do with the transport vehicle? They were clearly stalling for time. I'll try to follow them. Sugumi, could you send me their tracking data? I can't. There are so many Kagoros and Kyokas. They're all going in different directions. That's Kyoka's duplication power. They're attempting to confuse us. I'm sorry. It's going to take time to identify the real pair. I also lost sight of the transport vehicles. I hate losing. It was a diversion to hide the transport vehicle's destination from Sugumi. Which direction were the vehicles going the last time you saw them? I think towards Seiron. They must have been carrying something important if they made sure we didn't follow. We might be able to find out some key information. Give me some time. I'll see what I can find out with Sugumi's information. Yuito, there's a place I want to check out, but it's in a different direction from Seiron. It looks like the duplicates are all avoiding this area. I can't be sure, but it seems suspicious. Nice catch, Wataru. Okay, we'll go check it out. What is this place? There's nobody here. Hey, I see the transport vehicles. Then this must be it. We're pretty far from the city. Do you think this is still Seiron's facility? I can't seem to find any information on it at all, which only makes it more suspicious. Looks like they haven't noticed us yet, but I do feel a strange presence here. I can't really put it into words either. I will go check the vehicle. Sugumi. Wataru, please cover me. Hey, Yuito. Are you remembering things okay? What about your speech? Any headaches? I'm okay for now. No need to worry so much. You weren't making sense. It's natural for her to feel worried. Don't push yourself too hard. You've always had health problems, ever since you were little. That's right. You did mention that before. Yeah. I spent most of my early childhood inside a hospital. They finally let me leave when I was around five, and I've been fine ever since. Wait, 
Luca found something quite alarming. What do you mean? I know what the transport vehicles are carrying. Human heads? That can't be. The transport vehicle was filled with these. No, I thought I was just seeing things, but they're really... One of the trucks was already empty, but I believe it was carrying the same thing. Two trucks worth of human heads? What in the hell for? Let's try sneaking in a little further. Kasane and her team might be here. Okay. We need to find out why they're doing this anyway. Investigate. It won't open. I guess sneaking in is going to be harder than I thought. I can't use my clairvoyance on any of these doors. Hmm. Who are... Damn. Forgive the rough treatment. Don't worry, we only knocked him out. He won't be waking up for a while. Wow, all three of you were amazing. Thanks, I couldn't even move. I'm glad I have people like you who can make such quick decisions. Hold on, this might be a key card for the door. Nice find, Sugumi. We shouldn't have a problem getting in now. This puts us in enemy territory. I need to be ready for anything. Okay, let's try this door. Alright, I think it's time to end right here. I'll see you in the next one.